Hunnigan, what happened? The transmission got cut off. <laughs> Salazar, how'd you... We've jacked the line. We didn't want you telling everyone any unnecessary information. Where's Ashley? Ah, oh, so she fell into one of our wonderful traps. We'll make sure we find her. Don't you worry about her. Oh, yes. I let our miserable insects out for some exercise down in the sewer. Thanks. That should keep me company, because boredom kills me. I look forward to our next encounter. In another life. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to... Hey, what chapter are we in? Chapter 3-2? And we're actually going to start it off... I gotta show you guys the firing range. This is something you should probably do. Welcome. Because you get you get money for it, and you also get like these little collectible bottle caps. But hopefully, get through this. Not too bad. kind of focused. <laughs> Can't really talk, I guess. to do it one more time. Oh my gosh, I almost shoot Ashley right in the face. Oh, why am I reloading? Eh, might have to do that one more time. Maybe. We'll see. If he gives me money, I'm done. Okay. Looks like that was good enough. Um, I didn't really explain too much about that. But, uh, basically, so if you hit five in a row, that little thing spawns in the back and that gives you 500 points. That's pretty important. And, um, if you hit him in the head, you get 100 points instead of 50. But, to be honest, sometimes I think you just want to go for just the body shots because if they're, like, moving quick, you don't want to mess up your five in a row. That's just what I found. Two flash grenades, my goodness. Okay. Alright, we're gonna want... Shotgun out. Because we got bugs. That freaked me out. It sounded like there's a bug, like running right up to me. I think one of those...
Oh, shoot. There he goes. Green eye. They're gonna drop three types of eyes. Green eye, red eye, and blue eye. Blue eye is the rarest. I'm not sure. I wonder if I can... Uh... What's that? And uh, we're gonna get something we can combine with the eye, the eyes. I want the shotgun out. I wonder if the incendiary kill these bugs in like one. That, Cause that might be super useful. You know, we're gonna try it right now. Oh my god. Could be more useless. <laughs> uh. mess around with these things they can uh can do a bit of damage so looks like he was live recently judging by the wound it was a quick death music is still going Oh my god. That was so close. I see you on there. Oh. That's my strategy. Shoot him with the shotgun and then just pump him with the handgun. I actually think if you hit him in the eyes, they have like glowing eyes. It does more damage. Luis's memo, wait, 10 pages. There are some parasites that have the ability to control their hosts. It's basic knowledge among biologists, but cannot, but not is, but not much is known as to how the parasites do it. Studying these parasites specifically might reveal some clues to, as to how the powers of the last plagas work, and perhaps provide more insight on the victims of the last plagas, the Los, Granada, Los Granados. Here's a list of some parasites that have the ability to manipulate the behavioral patterns of their host. Di Dicrocolium. Once the larvae of this parasite migrates to the ant's esophagus, it alters the behavior of the ant. When the temperature drops in the evening, the infected ant climbs to the top of a plant and clamps onto a leaf using its mandible. It stays there immobile until the next morning, placing the ant where it's most vulnerable to be eaten by a browsing herbivore such as sheep. One could conclude that the parasite is manipulating the host's behavior to make its way into the body of its de definitive host, a galactosomum. The larvae of this parasite makes its home inside the brain of a fish, such as the yellowtail and the parrot bass. Once infected, the fish make their way up to the surf water surface where they swim until eaten by seabirds. Once again, this peculiar behavior can only be explained by the parasite's desire to get into the bodies of the seabirds. Leucochloridium. This parasite's sporocysts develop in the, in the snail's tentacles. The sporocysts are livid in color and pulsate continually, somewhat like a worm. Surprisingly, the infected snail makes its way to the top of a plant where it is more visible to the eyes of a bird, therefore more likely to be eaten. Once eaten by a bird, the parasite will complete its metamorphosis into an adult. Alright, that was super long. 
but who doesn't love some good science? See, this game is educational. That's what you tell your parents. Educational. As you're blasting people's heads off. Butterfly layup. And combine. Actually, let's just. Uh, the treasure. This is where you combine the eyes. Just need a blue eye now. Looks like a drainage valve. Drain the water? Yes. I think I'm gonna run into some more bugs here. But be ready. Oh my god. I didn't forgot about that. There might be one more too. Yep. Might be multiple, actually. <laughs> My goodness. with those blue eyes. Those blue eyes are hard to get. Those blue eyes white dragons. Not messing around with these guys. I haven't even gotten hit by them. Knock on wood. There goes all my handgun ammo, though. That's actually not that bad. Just totally unnecessary that that even exists, but whatever. Okay. All right, that was the sewers. I think this chapter is kind of long, so buckle up. Of course, they're alter they're worshiping the chili. I said down. <sighs> Gotta hurry before the loot disappears. Go, go, before the loot is gone. Get mask. Pretty important. Come down. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go 
Spinel's payday. Got them all. They're not fast enough. I think they disappear pretty quick, so. Dude. Merchant is just like, what is going on? <laughs> Why is this guy right here? Welcome. Got some rare. Think what are you selling? Right, let's sell all those spinels we just got. Peace. Is that okay? Not bad. Thank you. Is that okay? Thank you. Is that okay? There's gonna be another butterfly Thank lamp, so I'm gonna okay? sell. Thank you. I'm Thank gonna you. keep what are you them buying? just in case, even though I know I'm gonna be able to get more. Come back How much rifle? I gotta. Oh. And do this so I can visualize my what I have a little bit better. A lot of healing. Right, oh, we're here. my luck oh my god die I think took like I don't know why it wasn't registering the uh oh no he didn't These guys are like any range stuff is such a threat. Could be a guy over there I'm gonna get after I loot. For some reason he doesn't come and charge me. He probably should. Checking these paintings, just to make sure. Oh, that guy's still alive. He lived through that explosion. Oh. 
Uh, you can't really. I don't think you can kill this guy before he gets. He's gonna go to a certain spot. He's gonna be an asshole, right? If you don't know he's gonna be there, then it's kind of they kind of get a cheap shot. I think there's gonna be one. <laughs> it's his hand gun here. Oh, oh my god. Screw that, dude. How did I not hit him? I'm gonna use up all eight of these rifle rounds because I gotta get that capacity upgrade eventually. And I, w I wanna get some value out of it. Okay, let me uh, say I don't spend too much time on this puzzle. The sacrifice of six lives shall make way the true path. I did okay. Just gotta get it so there's six dead people. What a pleasant surprise! But I'm afraid it's Ashley we need. Not you, Mr. Kennedy. If you don't need me, then get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? It might come as a surprise. But I'm only 20 years old. So you're just like all the others? A puppet of the parasites? Surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados. The parasites, las plagas, are slaves to my will. I have absolute control. Well, I really don't give a damn. Rain or shine, you're going down. Get out your hand grenade. Real quick here. Are you stunned? Are you stunned? Get rid of all those guys. Fucking shit. Get down, you bitch. Oh my god. Crossbow shit is so annoying. Alright, one. Two. I'm just gonna kill that guy with that guy. Oh, okay. No, not Keech. What the? All right, dude. Oh my fucking Jesus! What the? Is there someone behind me? 
Oh my god! Dude, fuck you. Jesus. Oh my god. Oh, this is... All the crossbow, dude. I just used like all my healing right there just from crossbow stuff. Wow, range stuff in this game is just takes you so hard. could like go up this way I just didn't do that because I thought I could get away with ah, that guy was just behind me like I had no idea what I was getting hit from I'm like there should be no one behind me but he was just hanging out right on the stairs idea where those guys are. And then I got hit with the rockets. I did because I didn't know where they were uh, coming from. So I didn't know where to hide. I right, just kick this door open and just back up. Guys are I am one hit. What you're really supposed to do is probably go up through that passage and then, uh, go up through the passage and then shoot those little lanterns. I just I just didn't do it really the right way. Well, I got wrecked. Yeah. Thank God. Uh, I thought I would get something from that crow, but I guess not. Um, there's gonna be some crows up here. I might just use a snake. It was actually worth And this guy dropped too, I didn't even see that. Um, you can't go in here yet. Looks like yeah, you need help from someone. We all know what that means. Almost done with the chapter, just gotta get done with this maze. Mr. Kennedy, still alive, I see. So, do you like my garden? I see you've managed to work in a little of your twisted taste here, too. <laughs> Sagacious as I am, even I get lost here sometimes. Even if it takes your whole life, 
You'll never get out. Do you know that no one dies without a cause? You will satisfy the stomachs of my cute pets. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to tie up a few loose ends, like chasing down a couple of rats. Two rats? If one's Lewis, who's the other? Huh, they're an intruder besides me? Wonder who the other intruder is. Alright. Gonna have to be a little bit careful here because not much healing because I got destroyed by that part. <laughs> I'm sure we'll we'll find a little bit more healing in this, but uh Get your incendiary and just burn them. Because they will break out if you, uh, you wait too long. Sometimes there's people like around the corner. Actually, can I use this? Count? Oh well. Not gonna do his best for this. I'm gonna combine those really quick. Wow, that did an insane amount of damage. Not cool. There's nothing I could even do. Like, I couldn't even shake the keyboard or anything to stop it. It's just like, you just had to take it up the butt. First aid spray, that's pretty handy. Oh, what am I doing? Gotta get this guy out. Yeah. We have to go.
Got both of the new. Oh my god! I'm shaking. Oh man. Oh, there's our first aid spray. Good thing we got that. I almost thought that there that, that something like that was gonna happen. Ooh. Oh. Reload. It won't open. There's an indentation here. Two moons make one. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. Huh. Bit of advice, try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. Leon. Long time no see. Ada. So it is true. True? About what? You, working with Wesker. I see you've been doing your homework. Why, Ada? What's it to you? Why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> See you around. Ada! Alright, and that's the end of the chapter. Thanks for watching. Uh, sorry for the language there. Just getting a little frustrated with the crossbow guys. Alright, I'll see you in the next episode.